bust. Hello, I am the Red Monk. I haven't uploaded in like a week, and that is because I have absolutely fucking lost it. Now I'm I'm f so fucked in the fucking head, man. I swear I'm wearing sunglasses. Ugh. To hide the evil eye. Ooh. And this craziness has been brought on. You know, to the fact that you can't trust no one. This, this is what I've become aware to in the last week. And it has driven me off the fucking wall. This shit is fucking driving me off the fucking wall. And I'll tell you. I'll fucking tell you. That you cannot trust anyone. Don't trust. I mean, this is just factual information, man. If you put your trust in someone... They're bound to screw you over. It fucking happens. This is, you know, if someone put their trust in me, and I, I would either have no idea that it was even there in the first place, and I wouldn't fuck it up. But when you give your trust into someone, they'll fuck it up. But you never fuck it up. So you, you need to learn to work around this. And the best way to avoid getting fucked over is to trust no one. I don't trust a single nigga out there, my guy. It's just, this. And man, I've just been, the last week, man, I've been off the fucking wall. I've been absolutely creamed. Just, I had a good thing going, too. And then, I wasn't even intentional. Like, I'm just walking by, and it was just in the corner. I'm just like, trust, and phew, knocked me the fuck out. Representing the hog, though. Trying to fucking replace that shit with Skynet. Trying to fucking replace my enlarged rat with Skynet. That's what it's like sometimes, man. But, here's the story. Here's the fucking story. This is the narrative I would tell you to express my opinion. And this opinion needs to trust no one, man. Because they fuck you over. Just consist on the consist. They hit you with that shit. And it fucking sucks, right? So, I was employed. I mean, I've worked a few jobs. I've worked a few motherfucking jobs. I ain't, I ain't saying that I haven't had multiple careers, but I can hold down the jobs. You know, like I actually do what I can, right? And I lost another fucking job. And this is, I lost this job because I put trust in someone and it's been driving me fucking crazy. And the fact is, man, they're so fucking inconsistent and you're just powerless to it, man. You just gotta, you just gotta Cut the losses, cope with it, and move on. You know? So, I'm back on Indeed. This is where I'm, this is where I am again. I'm on Indeed. Fucking, looking for more jobs. That is so fucked. And, I think, this trust, I should have made a step. If I would have, con I did nothing. So I should have, I just sort of stand there and I'm like, what the fuck? I'm just riding on the shit, right? So I'm just riding it. And the shit comes at me, man. If I just sit here, that shit will hit me. That's what happened to me a week ago. A week ago, I'm just sitting here and the shit's hitting me. What you gotta, what you gotta do is you gotta juke that shit, right? You gotta dodge it and it'll miss you. I should have dodged it. All I had to do was move, but I've chose inactivity. You can still live a good life and have no trust in anyone. You can still live a really fruitful, um, white picket, good fence, and not trust a single pair of tits out there. Right? You can still go on and be happy. You can still talk to people. You know, have a good time. You can still make friends and produce offspring and live in the the utopia. And still put your trust in no one. They've, there's very little shit you gain by putting your trust in anyone, period, and just cutting it away. It's, it's fully a risk. All you get with trust is you just get something to put your back to. But I tell you, man, you need to be around of your surround. You need to be aware of your surroundings. You need to know what is going on around you. 
you need to know what is going on around you, right? So if you choose an activity, you gotta you gotta dodge that shit. Is what I'm saying. You know, you just continue your life. You know, don't inactivity against the general landscape of Jukin is you need to move to Juke. You need to move to Juke. So I tell you, man, just you can still be nice. You know, just because you don't trust someone doesn't mean you got to be a dickhole to them, right? Like, let's say I don't trust my coworkers. Let's say I don't trust my coworkers. I guess people will be like, yeah, this is the, the Penguins game was good yesterday. Yeah, how was your weekend? That's good. You can still talk to them. You can still work with them. You can still sell shit to them. You can sell your fucking uh, doobies and PS3 to them. And they can give you money. You can have transactions. But just don't fucking trust them. Don't give them something. Just in his word that he'll give you something back. In a week. What you gotta do he'll fuck you over. So just make sure you're... Just don't trust them, man. You gotta be aware of your surroundings so you can juke. So. All in all. Conclude. It's not a reason to be a dick hole. You can still be a nice person and don't trust shit, right? Like, just because you don't trust someone doesn't mean you still can't use them to your benefit. And people work better. People are happier when they're happier and they make you happier and you want to be happy. Right, you you want to be happy. You want to have positive emotions. So you have everyone from everyone else around you doing good. And that's the end of all. All you have to do is just have other people around you who are good. Right? Don't if you hang around people who are inactive, who don't who put their trust in people, they'll get fucked over. You don't you don't exclude them from society. Exclude them from society because they are only dealing with bullshit, right? It's not their fault. They're stupid, but they need to become untrustworthy. People with trust get fucked over on every single fuck. That is so consistent. So I'll tell you. Just don't trust. Still live, be happy, do whatever you're going to do, but just always look behind you. You know, if they're going to fuck you over, they're not your friend. But if they're not fucking you over, and they haven't fucked you over, just be cool with them, man. All I'm saying, you know, is being an untrustworthy individual is not an excuse for being a cock. So, yes. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye. But